Hello there guys and welcome back to another Python tutorial. So now last last episode or last video we made the text um flashing text which I'll link above with a card. Um if you haven't watched it obviously. Uh but this one here we're gonna go ahead and make three colours. So we're gonna make it is it that one that one that I'm linking above or the linked above. Um <coughs> That one only had two colours that it flashed between, uh, white and green. Uh, and so we're going to try and go ahead and make three colours. <laughs> now, to do this, we're going to do something a little bit different. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to go, say, uh, select... Oh, no, don't do that. Select underscore colour. And now we're going to write an if statement. So, if... Elif else. <laughs> so if the count is equal, uh, if the modulus of count, modulus of count, sorry. So modulus of count is, modulus 2 of count is equal to 0, then do this, which is color, a cell underscore color equal to uh so we actually put it in here we'll put a red in we'll put a red red okay so cell color equal to colors zero now we can go ahead and copy this over in a second but we're going to go and we're going to go else and we're going to go count modulus of three is equal to zero. All right. Now we want to go drag, drag this, copy this, copy, paste modulus of thing is one, and modulus of this one is two. So that's getting the white, the green, and the red. And if we run this now, hopefully, nope. <laughs> Okay, so, list indices must be integers, not tuples. Okay. Now, ah, uh, I see what I've done here. That is supposed to be just in general select color. So, cell underscore color, because it's passing in a variable. Um, and I spelt color the New Zealand way. <laughs> or the non-American way. Okay, there you go. So, as you can see... We have it flashing three colors. And one thing that I'm probably going to notice is because of the way that we've done it, it's going to flash the other two colors more than it flashes the green. And that is only because the modulus of two comes up. Well, it's going to flash, uh, hold on, let's have a look. It's going to flash the white the most due to the fact that white there's a modulus of 2 more often than there's a modulus of 3. And there's also a modulus of 3 more than there. Wait. Yeah, there's a modul there's no modulus. So modulus of 3 is the most um uh the most un, un uh, how do I say this? Is the least common of the 3 but yeah, that's that's how I would do a color switching thing like this. You can see it works, although it does flash red and red and white a bit more than the green. Um, but it does have that extra color in there. Um, you could probably. I'm just trying to think how you would change that up. So it would flash. I guess you could do a random number between one and two for a modulus of of nothing, or something. I don't know. So it would flash randomly between the two. Um, but yeah, that's how you could do it. Or you could obviously run a random um, number between one and three and have colors. Uh, and so it would just flash between the three random colors, but then you get two colors in a row sometimes. So that would mean that some sometimes the same color would be repeated uh, a bit more than the others. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Um, that's all I've really got for this video, so I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs> Alright, hello there guys. Um, you've obviously made it to the end of the video, uh, so you've obviously enjoyed it or had to watch the whole thing at least. 
So if you could consider subscribing, that would be a great help to my channel. Um, if you have any suggestions for future videos, make sure to drop them in the comments below. Um, like the video to show your support uh, to me so that I can know whether you like the content that I'm making. Um, and yeah, hope to see you in the next video. See you.